with the one and only, Xavier Porter with the one and only, Richardson Hitchens. You know what I mean? It's my man right here, he doing his thing. Moving very well, man, with the promotion, social people for life. Rich, what's going on, man? You got a fight Saturday, how we feeling, man? I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. Yeah. That's it? You ready to go? I'm ready to go. <laughs> Let's get it. Yeah. Let's do the shit. Let's do the damn thing. I'm ready to go. Yeah. Great training camp. Uh, tremendous. I had a fun summer, enjoy myself. It's time to work now. It's time, yeah. to, time to get these fights over. 2019, I got a lot of surprises. Yeah, we, cooking, we cooking up. Okay. We, me and Lennon spoke it over. We're going to definitely make the fans see a lot more. Okay. All right. Now, with this fight, you know, I'm assuming once you get the win, KO, yeah. you trying to, are you trying to get back in the ring sometime this year? Or? I'm back in November. It's already November. In Vegas. Oh. So, so, so you the first to know I'm back in November in Vegas. Okay. And it's for sure. First week in Vegas, expect me. Maybe TV. This is a big year. Wow. So we're going to we gonna, we, we gonna make, make some big things happen this year. Okay. The boxing world, we definitely going to be speaking about it. Okay. Now, back in Vegas, is that like on um, Mayweather promotion card? Yeah. Or is that? On the Mayweather promotion card. Okay. Yeah. Are, are you able to share the details on that or not? Huh? Are you able to share the details on that? I gave you all the details. <laughs> you got to hear first. <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's up. All right. So anything about your opponent you know or it doesn't matter? Oh, yeah. I know that uh, he, he was a, a solid guy. Yeah. Coming up, he, he, I think he went like 8 no straight. He got two losses to top prospects that I grew up with. Yeah. One with the decision, another one he got knocked out. And um, and he got to see me Saturday. Yeah. Yeah. One thing, I, one thing I admire about you is that your work ethic. Yeah. You know, you, you are really one of, one of the hardest workers in boxing that I know of. Yeah. You know, I, I know you come out of the social crew, and, and y'all all are hard workers as well. Yeah. I see you moving your career a little differently. Can you speak to that? Uh, I just know what, what's, what's best for me. Yeah. What's going to take me to the next level. Like I said, uh, like I always say, I know what's best for me. Nobody knows else what, what's best for me. So um, as long as I keep winning, keep learning, it's all about boxing IQ. There's a lot yeah. of fighters these days. You, you get what you what you see is what you get. So I want to be able to switch it up. And when, I, and when, it's, and when it's there, and whenever the opportunity presents itself, I can switch up and adapt. I can do it. I, I can do it all. I can do it all, but it takes the right person to bring it out of me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? To bring the... And, I, and, and I'm not talking about the fight. I'm talking about just training. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah. The right trainer, I can draw, I can buy. But if the right trainer can focus on all the things, I can... I can be uh, a complete fighter. Yeah. Yeah. Now, you, you, got, you got a great team. You got your coach. You got Lenny. You got Sosa. You got Greg, strength and conditioning. You got a great promotion I'm working, team. I'm working with Andre Rosier. And hey, you work with, yeah. work with Andre Rosier. Can't, can't, can't leave Andre. Yeah, yeah. Can't leave Andre. <laughs> you know. He's helping out right now. I've seen the classic. My main trainer is uh, Leonard Wilson. Okay. Yeah. And I've seen the classic photo the other day with you and um, Daniel, ja Daniel Jacobs. And I know you get a lot of, you know, a lot of tutors and knowledge, knowledge from Daniel. What, what, can you speak on that? Um, Danny looks out for me crazy. Yeah. Like I said, like I just said, uh, if my feet is too flat, Danny gonna tell me. If, if, I'm, if I ain't turn my punches, he's like a third eye in him. And I'm grateful to have him, to be able to learn from him. And that's that's the things I like to be around. I like to be around people that's on a whole different level. But that's gonna make me want to pick it up. So. In regards to training, where do you prefer to train? Oh, it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Like I said, if I, once I'm around greatness and I'm around a solid team, we're going to get it done. I could, I, could, I could be in the gym with, I could be in the gym with just one punch with bag. I get my time on that bag. I'm around solid guys. I'm around smart. I'm, I'm good. Okay. Boxing, is, boxing is, is the basics. Sticking to the basics. I, I don't need a, a gym with a big strength conditioning, shape and conditioning ring, or none of that. I'm like the Philly guy. <laughs> yeah. I'm saying? This is, I'm the gritty side of now, on Saturday, you also, you, like I said, on Saturday, you're fighting on the park with your stable mate, Dylan Price, yeah. representing Mayweather Promotions. Yeah. How do you, I mean, this is like, what, y'all fall time together? Yeah, I don't know. Because y'all both fight, you know, y'all both yeah, we fight. Yeah, we fight a lot. Yeah. yeah. So how excited are you to, like, you know, bring, bring another fight back here to Barclays City? I mean, this might be my last fight in the Barclays for another year. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I, or it might be, I don't know. I might be front screen on and off, on and off. I'm Barclays a different state. Yeah. But I know I'm gonna be. I'm definitely seeing out of New York this year. Yeah. I'm excited about it. So I want to give the fans this like a. a I want to give 
this is probably like a going away party in the sort of I want to give a go away party so the Brooklyn fans have something to remind me, remember me for, and want to follow my career. Okay. So you leave. So is it fair to say they're gonna move you to another level, like you mentioned earlier, put your TV cards or put your TV cards in Vegas and things like that? Yeah, they're they gonna put me. I want to be on TV cards in Vegas. Yeah. You know, even the little cards that, that, that don't get exposed like this. Yeah. As, as long as I'm fighting and different people see me. reason why as to why you're not being on TV cards here now out here? I mean, there's no really no TV card, undercard TV cards. So yeah. I mean, they, even like the, the, the Serrano system, they find for a belt. They find like show extreme, like a, yeah. a, a streaming thing. So, but I, I want the, I'd rather go in the little, little card and get a TV time. Yeah. Because then the whole world can tune in. So I'm cool with that. Okay. Let everybody know your record out there now? Uh, I'm, I'm 5 and 0, Saturday, 6 and 0. Uh, Six and oh four knockouts we done for on Saturday. And um keep looking out for me. Where can they find you? Follow me on Instagram at Richardson Hitchens, R I C H A R D S O N H I T C H I N S on Twitter. He is Richardson. And um I fight for y'all. Keep following my career. I can't I can't do this without the fans. I just want the fans to keep tuning in and uh keep following my career. I, I can promise that I won't let none of the fans down. They need to know, man. They really need to know. You moving, you doing well, and you going straight to the top, man. You know what I mean? I said you moving, you doing well, yeah. and you got a good team foundation. Yeah. You going to keep going to the top. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to keep striving to the top. I'm, I'm going to keep climbing the ladder, keep getting better. Keep finding uh, the, the, the right fights and the best fights out there. And just keep showing the boxing. I'm, the, I'm one of the best in boxing. All right. Good looking.